Hi, this is Bob with Bob CNC, and if you were with us on our shop talk last week, uh, you heard me introduce what I call a self-squaring gantry. Sonny, the maintainer of the gerbil code, uh, and I have uh, come up with this idea where we could have a self-squaring gantry. Uh, Sonny has actually got the code written, and uh, we're going to use that for our KL7 series. However, the code, since it's written on an Arduino Uno, we can actually modify our E3 and our E4 to do this self-squaring gantry. So what is a self-squaring gantry? Well, on a gantry, you have two motors and they can, your whole gantry could get shifted at an angle. And you only have one home switch, so that it's just gonna home it in that position. Now typically, your gantry is square enough that it doesn't really matter. However, with this new system, you will have two home switches one on the X1 side and one on the X2 side, and they'll work independently. So when you home the machine, it will drive each side to its home switch, and then it'll work together. So Alright guys, so now that you know what a self-squaring gantry is, in order to modify your E3 and your E4, you're going to need to download the firmware, you're going to have to change a couple jumper settings on your microcontroller, and then you're going to need an extra home switch, and you're going to wire this in series and connect it to the Z home switch. I know that may not make sense, but I'll try to help you out with that on the uh, blog. Alright, so thanks for watching.